<laughs> oh gosh, right, okay, baby names now, everybody. Oh. When was the last time you met a baby Nigel? <laughs> Did anybody have a baby Nigel recently? Oh. No? Uh, well, the stats are in, and according to the Office for National Statistics, zero babies were called Nigel last year. Oh. Zero? Zero. And Stacey... That's a nice name. <laughs> <laughs> Stacey, there were just 13 babies called Stacey last year. God, that's You're extinct almost, Stacey. <laughs> what? What's happening before my very eyes? <laughs> Are you worried that our names are all going extinct? It's just not cool anymore. No. I don't think there was ever many Stacey's, though, <laughs> if I'm honest. I had a few okay. Stacey's in my school. I've only yeah. had one Stacey in my, in my whole school. Mm. I only know a couple Stacey's of Stacey's really now. Stacey's a cool name. Oh, thanks, Kate. Mm, I like I Kate. do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, we've got one here. Lorraine says her son was born in 2003 and is the only child called Nigel. We know <gasps> he loves it. I suppose it is. It's a big name for a small thing, isn't Nigel. it? Nigel. Yeah. <laughs> Nigel. <laughs> You're yeah. wanting a suit. You're wanting a yeah. tie. Like Malcolm, I think, is quite a big name. Mm, Malcolm's Malcolm. a big name. Malcolm. Albert, Bobby Jay says her little boy's called Albert. Yeah. I love his name. I wish he'd give That's quite popular one. my other son an old-fashioned name. But what's coming in? Is it like tomato and vegetable and, you know... We needed that. Orange. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. No, apple. 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 We're apple. losing apple. Nigel to apple. Yeah. 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 Well, it says here, um, no one was called Colleen at all. <gasps> really? Zero. Yeah, that is on the extinct list. Oh, my goodness. Well, yeah. Cool. Has yeah. anyone Call told Colleen and tell us I think we should. Let's call yeah. Colleen. I know. <laughs> Alongside Doreen, Myrtle and Norma. Oh, oh I love Myrtle. Oh, I yeah. love that. Myrtle's and Scylla, actually. So, oh, yeah. Good. I remember when I said to my mum I was going to call um, my child Bonnie, she said, but what if she's no? <laughs> <laughs> Thank goodness she is, because it is yeah, true. I mean, it's the amount of thought we all put into it, though, isn't it? Like, it is a big thing, and then I there's... Just, the... I had a friend of mine that called her son Angel. That's nice. I like that. Oh, that's I know someone big, who called her son Badger. Wow. Badger? Yeah. Really? Isn't and that I rude? swore never to tell anyone. <laughs> <laughs> do, do we think they're, they're weird names because they're older? Because they're names of people we know now that are older, yeah. do yeah. we feel weird about calling our baby that name yeah. just because we associate it with an older person? Yeah, I think it will come back round again, like me. Once, but once all the Nigels are gone, <laughs> then we'll start. It will yeah. be a renaissance, <laughs> exactly. Well, apparently, we are influenced by celebs and things as well. I think Harper has made a bit of a research yeah. this time yeah. around mm -hmm. as well. Mm -hmm. And Harry, I think, is one of the big sort of boy names. So mm -hmm. we, we definitely are sort of sucked yeah. in yeah, by what's happening. And then the older generation there. don't like that. Apparently, Mum's Night did a poll. And Grannies and grandpas don't like. Here's the list: Tabitha, Aurora, Elijah, Charlotte, Finn, Jack, Lindsay, Noah, and Sally. They don't like them. Okay, oh, there we go. Bear right. that in mind, folks. Well, there you go. <laughs>